Uh, it was a good win. You know, overtime with DP scoring that two-point conversion, that was a good win. And we put that behind us, and now we moving on to Arkansas. You know, it's a big game, a rivalry, of course. And, you know, we got familiar faces, but it's still the same thing, one and know, uh, play by play. So we'll take it day by day. Uh, he keeps his composure, you know, like every athlete, they make a mistake, you know, you'll see it on their faces and if they express it, but overall he keeps his composure, comes comes back and makes better plays and, you know, he don't let that one play dictates the rest of the game for him. He comes back, keeps his composure and it's the next play mentality with him. I mean, honestly, that don't really matter to me. The thing that really matters to me is when you're on the field, is this play, how do I execute this play? What can I do to execute the play, to get an explosive play, or whatever else I need to do? And that's really how I see it. Uh, their defense coverages, it's like a three, three deep, five underneath. And so we got some plays and I know like bring them up what, what I can bring to the table. I know that I'm going to save it for Friday, but you know, I'm looking forward to Friday and making big plays. What are some of the things that you think you can bring to the table? Uh, explosive plays, third down conversions, you know, perimeter blocking. Uh, key in the defense, trap corners, getting those block zones for the O-line so they won't have to do that. And those are like the details on my end. You're, you're having your, your best year. How anxious are you to get that first touchdown? That <laughs> yeah, it is. But, you know, I don't really let that nag to me. But I take it day by day, game by game, you know. But it's always in the back of my mind, like, Basically, the end of the season, you know, I don't got a touchdown. But at the end of the day, you know, I'm not a selfish guy who's like, I don't got a touchdown. I need a touchdown. I'm, I'm genuine. I like to see everybody succeed. And so it's not really a big deal to me that I don't really have a touchdown. Yeah, you, you seem like you really developed that, that deep thread connection with, with Connors. Now, how long has that taken to, to develop? And you, you guys are just on the same page when he needs it. Uh, it's, it's really, it, it's like a 50 50. You know, I've done my part, like, the details, stance and start, closing space against the DB, throwing first, you know, stacking them and going and track the ball down. That's just something I've been working on. And so I've been improving on that, and I like where it's headed. Talking two years ago against Arkansas, I mean, you had that kind of that, I want to say 50-50 catch. I mean, what do you remember from that, that day and kind of your growth since then? Uh, I remember, I still remember it was the wrong play. Uh, TP, Taylor Powell, he gave us an uh, audible. I was supposed to run a delayed slant. Dom Jacinto had the width fade from the slot. And so I ran the original route to post. And so I seen the ball go out, made a play, came down with it. And I still remember that because, like I said in the interview before the season started, it's those, like, how I started versus how I'm going to end, you know. The same way I came in is the same way I'm going to end, you know. Uh, yes, it was. My first college catch.